Yes! Tiana's finally met her. She met Lottie LaBeouf. Why does Kit feel more horny these days? He's done more lovemaking as an old man than ever before. Just calm down, man. She's just making herself a home here. Oh my god, Lottie set fire to the room! What is going on? Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of the Sims 4 Disney Princess Challenge. The Disney family have returned home from their birthday party for the two boys, Kit and Walt. Tiana is trying to get her aspiration up by reading with Cinderella. So far she's read two books, so I do hope that she will fulfill that aspiration. So she has four days left till she becomes a teenager. So in that time, I kind of want to get that aspiration up. Oh, she's finished reading. Uh, Cinderella, you are not done just yet. Oh, it's a Monday, which is not ideal. I just want to push it just a little bit. Here's Walt. Look at him. I gave him such a cool makeover. He's got tattoos like his father. And he's just super trendy. Just lots of bright colors and flashy designs. And he's got glasses as well. Oh my god. She's going through the books too quickly. Come on, Cinderella. Take your sweet time. Want to get that aspiration up. Can we read other books? No, it has to specifically be children. Oh, this game is just fussy. Right, I'm going to have to buy another book. How I dumped your father. <laughs> well, that is a way to teach a kid about divorce. Okay, so I have that book. It seems like I can read that. Okay, so the game is not too fussy about genre, as long as it's appropriate for children. But seriously, How I Dumped Your Father, is that really an appropriate children's story? Oh, he's feeling buzzed because he's had some coffee. Yes, I've decided that instead of the microwave, I replaced it with the coffee pot. So yeah, I'm encouraging Walt's new fascination with coffee. She's just finished the other book. Did you actually reach... <gasps> She did it! Yay, she reached the two hour mark. Okay, so then she can finish her homework while focused. You can go to sleep. You only have one hour left, so <laughs> enjoy that little precious break. Uh, I have noticed that Babs is the only one that likes to come to the garden. <laughs> She's getting extra close to Cinderella. You are a very inquisitive creature, Babs. So, Walt has already helped himself to a second cup of coffee. He is that addicted to it. It's a good thing that he doesn't have school today, uh, otherwise he would be very exhausted. Oh, great. <laughs> I can probably guess what happened here. I think we should get Walt uh, an item that he can build skills on. I think I should get him a camera. Ooh, the crystal clear camera. It says, made for the true perfectionist. Okay, that's the word here. Perfectionist. Capturing over a gajillion pixels per photo. Jesus Christ, you could take a life-size picture of Jupiter with that camera. That is impressive. We're getting rich. <laughs> We're not supposed to be rich, but we are rich. So I think there is no harm spending a couple thousand. There you go. A birthday present for you, Walt. Oh no, Cinderella's too tired. Okay, we're gonna have to get Walt to help. He's never worked the farm before, but I think he can do it. Oh no, Ginger, you can't be thinking of a fight now. Oh, she's even more hostile than Bunty. And he's already exhausted, he's gonna pass out as well. Okay, Kit, what are you doing? You're watching TV, you lazy thing. Why don't you go downstairs and help out? And Tiana's back from school. She's got a project. Why don't you bring over a friend to help you out with the project? <laughs> your only friends are your family members. No, I want I want school kids. Oh, we could bring your cousin over. Yes, let's get to know the cousin. Oh, that was a very quick phone call. Simon's like, yep, thank goodness. I'm getting out of my mum's house. Where are you going? Oh, he's gonna go and admire the farm, I suppose. Oh, I'm getting a sense that Babs is the social one. She likes interacting with the humans. Hello, Cousin Simon. No! 
Tiana, why do you have a thing of just leaving them the moment you bring them into the house? Oh, Uncle Mickey, he's inviting him to the humor f and hijinks festival. Well, you know what? Why not? Uh, I will bring Simon and Tiana as well. So here we are, the hijinks festival. Uncle Mickey with his nephews and niece. Which one is Walt gonna go for? I think he's gonna go more for the pranksters. Tiana might go for jokesters. Yeah, let's get a competition. See which of the siblings will win. Oh, we got one of the skeleton kids. She does look a bit like her dad. Oh, we got the Joker, Clarabelle's husband. What are you doing without Clarabelle? Where is she? Oh, we got Jon Snow, the celebrity. Oh, Kylo Ren, he's old. Oh no. <laughs> Oh dear, Tiana's not very good at comedy. Simon's quite bored already. Oh, Charlie Chaplin's doing his stand-up comedy. I bet he's an absolute professional. Oh, Kylo Ren's loving it. Oh cool, Simon is attuned to it now. Oh, there's his mom. What is Anastasia doing? She's just trying out some food. Oh, she's gonna go up to her son. Okay. And she just abandons him. What the hell are you doing, Anastasia? What are you thinking? Is this for him? What is it anyway? Broquette. Ooh. Do you know what? We're gonna eat that. Get out of the way. Tiana is going to eat the food that Anastasia brought. <laughs> She's gonna try out some new food. Oh my god! Mickey just aged! Oh. Well, he's caught up with the rest of the family. That was a sudden transformation. No, Walt's just disappeared. I don't know where he went. Oh, he's gone to the art gallery. Well, that makes a lot of sense. Admiring some work, get inspired. If he weren't so tired, I would actually get him to try out these things, like maybe mold some clay or do a sculpture. And Tiana's team won. Ooh, 15 eggs. That's a lot of eggs. Oh, we got a green egg. Cool. All right, we'll keep that green egg safe because I feel like the green egg can give us some interesting stuff. Pears well of ham. Oh yeah, green eggs and ham. I would not eat green eggs and ham. I do not like them, Sam I am. <laughs> okay, it's the next morning. Okay, Tiana, it's time for you to get up and do your homework in time. Oh yeah, we have to get the aspiration. So finish homework while focused. All right, Kit is the only one who's up. Oh no. Walt's in his one of his melancholy blues. Or maybe it's just he's very lonely. Well, it's your first day of high school. You're gonna make some friends today. I mean, who can deny you? You are so fashionably cool. You're gonna make some friends in no time. So she needs to do it one more time and then she gets the aspiration. Cinderella, how are you doing? Oh, you're full of energy. It's time for you to get up, get into your farmer's clothes, sort out the farm. Yeah, I gave her a new farmer outfit. <laughs> just like in the thumbnail. Yay, Kit is finally helping out. He's straining his back to sort out the mechanics of the sprinkler. <gasps> yes! Tiana's finally met her. She met Lottie LaBeouf. Oh, Clarabelle's changing careers. Fantastic. What is her job now? She has become a tough gal. Have you been hired by your husband? Yes, I should have known this would happen. But if it's gonna get her some money, then yeah, I can't, can't really complain, I suppose. Oh, he doesn't like being handy. I guess he doesn't like it. <laughs> well, he's gonna be very uncomfortable now. But unfortunately, you're the only one who's very good at it. So that's why I keep getting you to fix things. Wait, what? I just realized Kit is a perfectionist as well. It's like as if Siri knew all along that Walt would inherit his father's perfectionist trait. I think everyone's gonna keep going for the coffee. It's like the same thing as a radio or a TV or a computer. That's the first thing all the Sims automatically go to. <laughs> what the hell? She's just given up on manners. She's decided to sit on the floor to drink her coffee. That's how desperate she is for coffee. Well, these watermelons look really sad urge to remain calm ah uh ha -huh, ha huh. good joke all right tiana you've met the person i wanted you to meet so no more befriending you're just going to focus on work now i want you to get that a Walt's met mirabelle yes mirabelle madrigal they've got similar kind of fashion they've got really good fashion what is kit doing he's just admiring the garden 
Oh, he's very flirty. He's he's asking for something. <laughs> he's just complimenting like, oh, I love a woman who works hard. Yes. Oh my God. Tiana's wanting to bring Lottie. Yes, we're bringing the Southern Belle. Where is she? Where is she? I want to see Lottie. There she is, the little pretty princess. Look at her. She looks so proud. She's even got her own little crown. I know you're very tired, but you're going to be absolute best friends with this girl. Oh, so who is this little friend here? It's a pleasure to meet you, Lottie. And now we are friends. Or oh, almost friends. Tiana, just because Cinderella's getting to know Lottie doesn't mean you go away. Oh no, Tiana's a mess. But it's okay, the little Southern Belle's going to enjoy some dancing. Oh, it turns out she is a massive fan of dancing. <laughs> That is exactly how I expect Lottie to dance. Uh, you're getting into my face, Lottie. You're almost elbowing me. Well, why don't you try out the camera? Let's do it with Dad. Hey, Dad, I want to try out some photography skills. So, could you pose with me, please? I knew you liked photography. Oh, such a cute photo. Walt, I just gave you the most expensive camera and you've wasted it with a blurry photo. Unacceptable. Let's do it again, please. Oh, this is even better. Yes, they're better. Oh, we got one with a little photo bomber. Ah! Wow. For a normal size photo, this is actually very big. Let's do it blue. And then I'm going to upload it to his Simstagram. I think he's the type to have a really large Simstagram account. Uh, no, Lottie, what are you doing? Uh, Cinderella, could you... Stop this for a moment. I know you're not her parent, but we need to stop this. Oh no, she's fallen right onto Lottie's new artwork. Oh, Cinderella and Lottie are really getting along. Oh, Walt, you're such a good boy cleaning up <laughs> while Tiana's still lying in there. Do we have gifts? <gasps> Give her health potion. Or we can get fireworks. Yeah, let's get fireworks as a present. Here you go, Lottie. As my new friend, I give you this. Does she like it? Oh, she likes it. Yay. <gasps> her empathy's up as well. How far is she? Ooh, her empathy is going so high. She's going to reach maximum. Yes. And her manners is good too. Great. She's going to be as good as Cinderella. Mm, they're still acquaintances. Yeah, all right, all right. We've done our best and it's getting late, so you can go to bed. I'm so glad you met Lottie. Yay. She's one of my favorite characters. I thought she was going to be just really, really annoying in The Princess and the Frog, but she's just such a darling. You just can't help but love her. All right, Walt's very angry today. No, 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 no. I don't want you to pick on Lottie. If you're in an angry mood, you best stay away from anybody. You just go to bed. She's just feeling very happy. She's like, oh, Tiana just brought such a charming friend. She's so lovely. Oh, she wants a makeout session. Woohoo, we kid, actually. Yeah, fine. He's been giving hints to you all day. So kids have gone to bed. Is Lottie still here? Yeah, she's made herself a home. She decided to make a potion of her own. Well, good thing you are stuck here. Just wait until the parents finish their session. <laughs> Yeah, they still got it. Oh, what's this? Dangerously tired. <gasps> oh, yeah. Because he's old, any exhilarating activity could actually kill him. Ooh, they really can't get their hands off each other. Yeah, she, she just wants to make out and just keep it going. But um, yeah, he is feeling uncomfortable. His heart cannot take it. It's too weak. No, no, no. You can't be having coffee. That's the last thing you should have if your heart is weak. Is Daddy LaBeouf not going to pick her up? <laughs> Are they just going to leave her here in the Disney household? We're not taking hostage. And we haven't even asked her to stay for sleepovers. So she's just making herself a home here. Kid, you got school the next day. You're going to be so tired. One eternity later. Lottie has been up all night with the potion table. She's absolutely obsessed with it. Is she not thinking about sleeping at all? Oh my god, the next moment Lottie set fire to the room. What is going on? Lottie, get out of there. Cinderella, you need to rescue her. 
Oh! What? What happened there? Who sprayed the water on the table? That was bizarre. That, something out of nowhere. Did I have a sprinkler? Oh. I don't see any sprinkler. That is amazing. Something or other has just put out the fire for me. And Lottie still continues making the potions, even though it's completely scorched and burnt. All right, we're going to ask her to leave because she's overstayed her welcome. She is already leaving. Okay. Well, can you go already? Cinderella is so stressed. She's just decided to grab some cake, undo her hard work on the treadmill. Yeah, I know. I know. Just wait for Lottie to leave. Bye, Lottie. Can you go, please? The table doesn't even work. Why are you still working on it? Child, can you go? Go back home. You have a home. Oh, finally. Okay, she's bursting for the loo. And she's out the door. Finally. The little child has realized it is time to go at 5 a.m. <laughs> long, long past her bedtime. Right, hopefully you know the way home. And I hope you don't get a huge lecture from your dad. Most likely you won't because he spoils you rotten. But honestly, a kid like you should not be staying in someone's house for that long and set it on fire accidentally. <laughs> oh, she is trouble. She's charming, but she is quite a troublemaker. Ah, oh, Cinderella feels better now that Lottie is gone. Mm, it's a bit too early to sort out the farm. Oh, we've got so much to do in the garden, actually. Oh, the pumpkins are turning out nicely. They are nice and orange. Wow, you can sell it for 200. That is so expensive. I am actually curious about this competition thing. I actually do want to take the competition. Oh, she's feeling very stressed out. She's not very happy at what her new friend did to her science table. I'm not going to invite her back here anytime soon. Just stick to school for now. Hang out with her at school. Kit! He's gone automatically to Tiana to help out. You are such a good dad, Kit. You are so good. No! Tiana! No, don't go to school yet! No, no, no. I don't want you to skip school, but at the same time, I want you to finish it. Ah, oh, damn it. We've got two chances before she becomes a teenager. We need to get that aspiration. Mimi's thinking about trying for a baby? We want to, but we're not sure. It's a huge responsibility. What do you think? What? Do you have the ability to do so? Mimi, you are old. Is it actually possible for you to have a baby? I'm just gonna encourage her, even though I know technically I don't think she can. Yeah, Cinderella loves children, so she's going to say, yeah, have that baby. Yes, we'll do it. Thanks for the advice. We're having a baby. You are having a baby or you will have a baby. I'm really annoyed that the flour and sugar hasn't arrived. I spent all that money and it still hasn't gone through. I don't know where these deliveries go. I'm going to do this one more time. And if it doesn't work, clearly there's something wrong with the game. What is she doing? What is she carrying? I guess she's carrying her umbrella, her invisible umbrella, inside the house. Oh no, her phone is stuck to her hands. We'll gather your order and send a delivery soon right over to the address. So, somebody should come. Please come. Hello, Babs. Are you trying to get into the house? Yeah, I know it's wet and miserable out here, but you don't belong in the house. Tiana's such a social butterfly. She wants to invite her cousin. Yeah, come over, Simon. Oh, Kit! Whenever Tiana does her projects or homework, Kit's always first to be there. Oh, that's so cute! Cinderella, you're such a cool aunt. Oh, Simon's loving it. He's like, oh, wow, this is magical. My mum can't cook like this. <gasps> no, Simon. You are taking some bad manners from your own mum. We need to sort you out with that. Can you actually teach him? Probably can't. Cinderella, it's your turn to help out with your daughter's schoolwork. <gasps> we did it! Yay, we made a little volcano. It's so cute. It looks quite good, actually, for a school project. <gasps> Yay, she's the responsible now. <gasps> and it's almost Tiana's birthday. Oh, okay. Let's do the homework. Quick. Look at Kit go. He's still got it for an old guy. Keep those creaky hits moving. Oh, Simon wants to leave. 
Okay. Well, thanks for coming over, Simon. Are they actually friends? Oh, they're very close to being friends, actually. Simon and Tiana. No, she's too tense to carry on with her work. Okay, um, right. We're gonna go up there and sort out empathy. It kills two birds with one stone. It gives her fun and it gives her empathy as well, which is very much needed. He's very happy today. You could try out some uh, photography. Why don't you go out there and take a photo of your mum while sleeping? <laughs> She's worked so hard at a farm and it's paid off. And we get this cute little photo here of her. We got outstanding quality. Nice. He's going to put that on his Simstagram. He's now got 40 followers. Great. I'm going to keep that picture up there because that's really cute. This is really interesting. We've got Kit right by the door. Uh, his empathy's up for some reason. Oh, it's got an aura to it. Oh, she's so close. Look at that. Look how much she's got. She's so good. So responsibility's all the way up. Manners, oh, she could do better. Oh, you're almost there. You're almost there, Tiana. Cinderella's trying to hold it in. She's like, Ugh. Okay, so irritated. Ah, oh, this child is giving the wrong answers. Okay, calm down. We can do this. She did it! Milestone complete, yay! So, she needs to get an A. Oh, I feel like she won't be able to get an A. But she wants to craft emotional potions and achieve level 10 mental skills. She's level 8! Oh my god, level 8? She's so smart. I think tomorrow's your last day? Oh no, you got two days. Okay. Well, maybe you do have time to get an A. We're gonna spend the rest of her childhood days on the potion table. Oh. Got a phone call today. <gasps> no! Meanie died! Oh no! It was not too long ago that she wanted to have a baby. Oh, that is very sad. I'm so sorry for your loss, Mickey. Meanie was her good friend. Oh, she's very sad. Walt feels bad for Cinderella as well. Oh, and it's almost Cinderella's birthday as well. She's gonna be old. Uh, it's new day. Cinderella's very sad. Oh. I think we will visit Mickey just to share our condolences and to just keep him company for a bit. Why is he tense today, Kit? Love Lord. Oh my god, why can't you stop thinking about getting it on with Cinderella? Just calm down, man. You almost killed yourself doing it. You're not as young as before. That's right. I think that's the best thing to do. Just let it all out on the yoga mat. Oh, he's feeling better. That's great. Oh, wow. These uh, big crops get weeds really quickly. Oh, look at the aubergines. Oh, they look so cute. <laughs> the pumpkins are doing quite nicely, actually. She's actually happy. At least she's keeping herself busy and she's quite pleased with herself. Oh, she's getting mood swings. Serious mood swings. <laughs> Oh my god, she's happy and sad. Happy and sad. Oh my god. Oh, oh we got the uh, gnomes today. We got uh, two death gnomes. Very grim. Let's give a toy. They look like they need some fun. Why do we have death gnomes today? Of all times, when someone is mourning the death of a loved one. Alright, does he like it? <gasps> Woo, we got the empathy up too. Oh my god, Kit, you are just flirting up the storm. You you can't get enough of her. <laughs> she wants to woohoo with him as well. All right, fine, you horny old man. Let's do it then. Oh, that is very creepy. The gnomes are just right up to them. And one of them's even looking up Cinderella's skirt. You dirty thing. Oh, she's full of energy today. She's ready for this. Just don't kill Kit. <gasps> Look at that! Right on line with the maximum! <gasps> Tiana's an A grade! That is so weird because she's been here at home the whole time. Yay, she's reached compassionate! Oh, what's back? Oh no, don't walk into this please! Okay, good. He's just grabbing some cake. <laughs> oh god, I wonder if he's just hearing everything. Whoa, uh, they call woohoo fitness training, which is kind of interesting. They're still really enjoying the woohooing. It's just that it's now taking a toll on Kit. Let's harvest the pumpkins. She's feeling very good about herself. We can start crafting potions. Is it a good size though? 
I mean, it's a nice quality at least. Right, what can we do with it? Apparently we can't do much. Let's just put them outside here. Just make it look very harvest festy. Kind of wish we could carve the pumpkins. Wait, can the kids do anything? No, they can't do anything. That sucks. Now we just have to let them sit there and rot. I actually get Mickey over to hang out. Come over and have a harvest fest lunch with us. We can make a tofurkey. Oh yeah, we're going all vegetarian today. Yes, let's make a vegetarian meal. Ugh, I could never know where Mickey is. He's always flicking in and out of places. Oh, there he is. Came out of nowhere. Hmm. Mickey is tense of anything. He doesn't feel too sad. Tiana's doing well on the science machine. Oh, she's almost level nine. Yay, Tiana made enough potions for the aspiration. So, she's got one more left. Oh my god, she can be level 10. Why don't you play with Mickey? She's an absolute whiz. I don't think he's going to beat her at all. Ooh, it looks good. It's not even a real turkey, which is even more impressive. That makes me wonder, do you qualify smart if you don't cheat or get away with cheating? It's pretty ironic that I've been dressing him up as Mickey Mouse with the black and red colour scheme only to find out that he doesn't even like the colour red. Oh, and he's very angry. Just thinking about it, just the fact that he has been born into wearing red and he doesn't even like that colour. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Mickey. Why does Kit feel more horny these days? He's done more lovemaking as an old man than ever before. What a surprise! Tiana the Brainiac just got beaten. It's like, ha! No child can beat me in chess. Even though I barely play that game. Oh no, Mickey is not going to stay for the tofurkey. Ah, uh, you're missing out. Yay, she completed it! She is now mentally gifted. She is just so smart. She's a super smart child now. Well, you got one hour left. You got half an hour, actually, to sleep. Whoa, the gnomes have left out a lot of seeds right by Snow White's grave, which is a very interesting place to put it. I think I'm gonna leave the gnomes by the grave. It's just appropriate. <laughs> Whatever you do, Ginger, don't eat the flowers and plants. Cinderella's so sad today that she's letting out some magical princess tears to grow her plants. Oh, Henry, he wants her to come over. She's got work, actually. So I'm gonna have to say no. Oh, he's old as well, so I'm I'm sad that he might die very, very soon. He feels like it's his final days. I am very annoyed that the the delivery never came. This is like third time I asked for flour and sugar, but it hasn't arrived, so what the hell? How am I gonna make a cake? Today is both the princess's birthdays. I think we'll have to go to a different place to have a birthday party. Okay, as soon as uh, Walt has his dinner, I am going to organize a party. Oh, it's so sad he doesn't know any of his other family members. Does he not know Mirabelle? Where is Mirabelle? Okay, so this is gonna be a very small scale party. The parents not even there, only Uncle Mickey and Cousin Simon are coming. Here is everyone. Look at Walt, he's on fire today. He absolutely slays in that outfit. And here's Uncle Mickey, he looks cool too. Oh, it's Kylo Ren wearing a suit. Oh, he's the entertainer. Oh, and there's Uncle Joker. Why is he dressed up like a homeless bum? What is he doing? Oh, it's Daisy. So she's the caterer today. Oh no. I have a terrible feeling that there is no kitchen. <gasps> no, we've come to the wrong park. Okay, here we go, Daisy. Get cooking now. Okay, we're just waiting patiently for our cake. Maybe we should say hi to Joker. He must have had a long job. I think he's disguised as like a graffiti artist or a homeless bum as part of his job. Oh, there's Anastasia. Do you want to say hi to her? Oh my god, Anastasia just gave her a hug. Ah, she is in a good mood. Oh, he's very tense about Joker. He's very intimidated by him. Cinderella's home. Okay, well, she can come over now. Oh, Anastasia likes classical music. Well, it is a villain's favorite genre of music, to be honest. Daisy, I asked you to make a cake. Where is the cake? Oh, there's the cake. But that cake is not on the table properly. Daisy, you did this before. Why do you keep putting it in random places? This is such an awkward place to have a birthday. Uh, we haven't got time, quick. 
Wakey, wakey, Tiana. It's time to celebrate. Happy birthday, Tiana! It's pretty straightforward for Tiana. All she wants to do is food related stuff. So let's just give her the Master Chef aspiration. I want her to go to the next level uh, compared to Cinderella. While Cinderella likes to cook in general, I think Tiana wants to make a proper career out of it. Like she actually wants to own a restaurant, just like in the movies. As for traits, uh, according to the rules, I have to give her a particular trait, which is ambitious. Where is ambitious? What? Even teenagers can't be ambitious? All right, fine. I guess I'll have to get Siri to help me out. Hey Siri, pick a number from 1 to 45. 20. Here we go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Oh, she's a dog lover! Yay, we could finally get a dog! I've wanted for a long time for the Disney family to get a pet. Tiana, oh my gosh, she's so beautiful! Alright, Cinderella, it's your turn now. Tiana, no! Cinderella was gonna age up, and you ate it. Oh, and that cake was eaten too. Oh. It's a loice, oh no, I don't really like Tiana's voice, to be honest. She sounds too Californian Valley girl. That is so fetch. Okay, so we're back home, and as you can see, Tiana's got a makeover, which you'll get a better look at in the next episode. Cinderella still hasn't aged up. I don't think she'll have a celebration tonight, which is a shame. But anyway, that is the end of the episode. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye for now.